On the 14th of January 1944, Dominic Salvatore Don Gentili leads a flight of the 336th Fighter Squadron, 4th Fighter Group, from Debden Airfield on a fighter sweep over France. On this day, Gentilly will become an ace, but will also have an unexpected brush with death. Leaving England, Gentilly leads a flight of four in his P-47 D-5 Donnyboy. His flight consists of Flight Officer Robert Bob Richards. Lieutenant Louis Red Dog Norley. And Lieutenant Vermont Garrison. The group flies towards Compiègne at 5,500 meters or 18,000 feet, where Gentilly spots 15 FW-190s heading east. The group dives to intercept them. Gently states, as soon as we went down, the 190 split fan-shaped into two groups. I picked two stragglers flying north. Gentilly hits the first FW-190 and observes smoke trailing after observing strikes on the cockpit. He immediately attacks the second FW-190, which he dives after as it begins spiralling to the ground. Gentilly continues, just as I pulled up, I was jumped by two 190s and the fun really started. Having been bounced, Gentilly enters a prolonged dogfight with at least two of the German aircraft, which he desperately tries to outmaneuver. Gentilly inadvertently flicks his P-47, narrowly avoiding crashing into the ground. He and the unknown German pilots begin a circling dogfight, expending ammunition and continuously reversing their turns to get on the other's tail. Gentilly is heard to call to his squadron mates, help, I'm being clobbered. If I don't make it back, tell them I got two.
After some time, the leading German is seen to be out of ammunition and without any ammunition himself, gently makes for England, having sustained damage from a 20mm hit. 